Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is a video of my wash day from start to finish. So pre-poo, shampoo, conditioning and leave-ins. Um, finally, this is how I styled my hair. No, not styled, this is how I'm stretching my hair. But this is not shown in the video. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to subscribe and click the like button. I'll see you again in my next video. I apply coconut oil onto my hair as my pre-poo. I hadn't moisturized my hair in such a long time, in about two to three days, so it was just feeling coarse and just very dry. Just work that coconut oil into my hair and onto my scalp. So I'm done with applying the coconut oil as my pre-poo. Um, for now, I'll just put on my shower cap. Make sure it covers every bit of my hair. And then I'll wear my heating cap. So I'll have this on for about 15 minutes. Um, So it's been about 15 minutes, my hair is nice and hot, so I'm going to wait for it to cool down before I jump into the shower to do my shampoo session. For shampoo, I use the shampoo from the Body Shop, it's the Rainforest Moisture Shampoo for dry hair. It has some oils in it and some honey, it's a great shampoo, I love it. I'm also going to instant condition and also detangle while I'm in the shower. I'm using this product which is new from Garnier. I picked it up yesterday. It's the Garnier Ultimate Blends Conditioner. It's the Nourishing Repairer with Avocado Oil and Shea Butter. So I'll detangle while I have the Instant Conditioner on my hair using my In Shower Comb. I have the conditioner on my hair. I realized I forgot to show you guys how it looks like. It has a normal cap like that and then it's pretty runny. Not too runny though. So this is what it looks like. So it has the consistency of usually my normal deep conditioners. I can tell you now, as I put it onto my hair, I was like, wow, it just made my hair so soft. I haven't done any combing, I've just done any, I've just done some um, going through my hair with my fingers to make sure that all the deep, all the conditioner is on the hair so how i do the step i just section off a bit of hair i'll start with the fingers just to get rid of some of the tangles the conditioner slip is amazing I don't really section off my hair because it's a bit short right now. It doesn't stay in sections. This is a wonderful instant conditioner just from first impressions. Wow. I'll see how my hair feels afterwards, but I'm definitely loving it. Right, so I've been drying my hair for about 10 minutes. I'm going to take it out now. My hair feels really soft and just... I really really like this deep con this instant conditioner. So for deep conditioning, I'm going to use the Dark and Lovely Amla Legend Rejuvenating Ritual Replenishing Hair Mask. And to that I'll add a bit of my castor oil. That's how much I add. My castor oil is running out. Let's mix that in the bowl. Uh, then I pour that to my hair. finished with applying the conditioner onto my hair and now I'm going to steam it onto my hair using my um, clothes steamer. I did write a lot about the steamer last year so I will link some of the blog posts where I wrote about it below so you guys can get more information but safety first that is why I am just wrapped around in this towel because the steamer is quite dangerous. So 
So I've just finished steaming my hair. I'm going to put on a shower cap again just to trap the heat and wait till my hair cools down. So I've rinsed out the conditioner for my hair. And I've been towel drying for about, I'd say 15 minutes. And now I'm going to go into it with my leave-ins. For leave-ins, I'm going to spray with my moisturizing spritz. Then I'll use my Elastic QP olive oil and mango butter and seed breakage leave-in conditioner. And then I'll seal that all in with my whipped shea butter. My hair feels pretty soft. I like it. So that's my wash day done and dusted. I'll just let my hair dry now. All this white residue will disappear as the hair dries. Um, I'm not sure what kind of styling I'll do. I think after it's sufficiently dry enough, I am going to thread it for the week. Just to straighten it because um, my tangling is getting real now when my hair is, when I don't stretch out my hair. So I tried to stretch it out for the week using threading or flat twisting. That's my entire wash day video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. See you again on my next video. Bye.